So now we've got our laser set up and we're ready to align the axis. To do this, you'll need a grade rod, the remote control, and the laser eye and a tape measure. Our laser is set up. We need to measure from the center of the laser over to our wall that we're grading up against, the center being right here. Six foot nine to the center, the laser off the wall. And then the next thing we need to know is what axis we're trying to align. The X axis or the full triangle here is gonna spit out a beam that, that's like this. It's gonna spit out grade like this. The Y axis or the empty axis here is going to come out of the laser like this. That's the axis we want to align. We want to align the Y axis. So when we go to the opposite end of the building, we want to align the Y or the empty. So we've walked to the other end of the building. We've determined that the laser is six foot nine away from the building. I have measured away, six foot nine away from the building for my grade rod. So now my grade rod and my laser are equal. They're parallel with the building in a straight line. Now I'm ready to align the axis. Turn my laser eye on. And it doesn't matter whether the eye is reading tone, whether it's high, whether it's low, it can be anywhere in that range, just as long as it's seeing the beam. So if it's there, that's not gonna work. just as long as it's seeing the beam. We've determined that I need to align the Y axis. To align it, you hit menu, the one button, and it'll give you a list of options. You can scroll through. There's multiple options in here, but we're looking for axis alignment. We'll hit the seven button to scroll over. Axis align, enter with the number four button there. And again, it's gonna give you some more options. You can scroll through. It gives you a couple different options. We're looking for a line axis Y. So there, I'm on it there. Number four button again to enter. And you'll notice here, it says AA, axis align. And you'll also notice here on the remote, that the Y axis is giving us an icon for axis alignment, while the X axis is just giving us a level beam. So now the laser is communicating with the eye, talking back and forth, trying to figure out where it's at. It's important when you're doing this part that you don't move the, the grade rod this way. If you do that, that'll throw off the alignment. Something else to consider when you're setting this up, the alignment itself can take anywhere from three to five minutes. So it's important that you figure that into your setup time during the day. It's nothing worse than trying to set something up and having stone trucks rolling in, getting you all hot and bothered. So now we can see here that the alignment is completed because there's no axis alignment icon. Both axes are reading the level bubble and we're getting solid tone on the eye again. So that's telling us that the axis alignment is complete and we're ready to perform our work for the day.